Hi, I'm Don Curry, Chief Instructor of the NSCA. One of the biggest challenges we deal with as instructors is making sure we've got a student that has a well-fitting gun before we begin a lesson. One of the ways uh, and one of the particular problems that we can run into is a gun that has uh, too much drop at comb. This is called the comb of the gun. When we have a gun that has too much drop at comb for the shooter, say a shooter with a high cheekbone, the shooter's eye comes down below the rib. When the shooter's eye comes down below the rib, the shooter really can't see the target as they're executing the shot. So what can we do about it? Well, this video is not paid for in any way by Beartooth Comb Riser, but this is just a product that really works and really works well. I use it a lot, and I've always got a couple of them in my bag. The Beartooth Comb Riser comes with a little neoprene wrap that you slip on, and I'll show you how we're going to do that. And then it also comes with a set of little inserts or risers. And each one of these risers is a different thickness, and we can use the appropriate thickness for the, the particular student to make sure that that eye rests nicely on top of the rib, okay? So the first thing we're going to do, and you'll notice that this gun actually has an adjustable comb, so normally I wouldn't be using this at all, I'd just adjust the comb. But we're going to, for the purpose of the video, we're just going to assume that we don't have an adjustable comb on it. First thing you want to do is take the, uh, the neoprene wrap out and uh, make sure that uh, the small end is the end that you're going to put on first. So, and the seam is on the bottom, near the toe. So we put it on, we put it on the top of the, uh, the comb right there, the, the, the thinnest part. Then we sort of stretch it down over the toe with the seam on the bottom. Once we get the top and the bottom over the butt pad, now we're going to roll the back of the, the neoprene wrap over so everything's over the butt pad and then we're going to pull the whole thing down. Once we get the whole thing down now we're going to pull it back up again and make sure that we get it over the peak of the comb so that it nicely lays on top of the comb. And it'll take you some working around to get it exactly right. We want to make sure that the seam's on the bottom not against the face because that would be uncomfortable for the shooter. And now we've got our bare tooth neoprene cover, very nice, no wrinkles, uh, very smooth. Once we get that in place, now we want to roll that neoprene wrap back down, making sure we keep the lower lip, or the, the back lip, all the way down, okay? And we, we bring it all the way down until we've just got a little bit left before we hit the peak. Then we take whichever, whichever insert we've determined is the appropriate insert for the student, to, uh, so that the student's shooting eye is resting right on the rib. And we want to put that insert on top of the gun, assuming this is a right-handed shooter. We want to position it and then wrap the neoprene piece right over the edge of, of the insert. Now, when we line it up, we want to make sure that the left side of the insert is flush with the, uh, the, the inside of the, uh, the stock. The reason is we don't want to create cast, cast on, all we want to do is create lift, okay? We want to create height at comb, we don't want to create more cast, unless that's something, or less cast, unless that's something that you want to do. Once we get it to this point, we roll it up just a little bit, and then we find something to rest it on, like the golf cart, hold it against our waist, and and now you can see that the uh, insert is very nicely against flush with the, the left side of the gun from the shooter's perspective. And now, and this uh, insert will have created height and without any additional cast on. That's pretty much how you do a field expedient gun fit and gu an adjustment to gun fit for a student before a lesson. Now, hopefully that student's eye will come, come up very nicely sitting on the top of the rib. You see I've got an empty gun. I'll show you what that looks like. For more tips, see the rest of the tips on the website.